Hey guys, welcome to KKJ Tutorials. In this video tutorial, I am going to show you uh, how to use truncate command uh, in SQL. Truncate command comes into DDL, data definition language. So basically when you decide to remove all your records from a specific table, then you can use truncate command. Truncate is uh, much faster than delete command. Truncate is similar to delete, but uh, in delete uh, when uh, you want to delete uh, some records based on the certain condition, right? So how do you write delete from table name and you have option to specify the where clause, right? So you can uh, delete the selective records and when you trigger the, basically when you run the delete uh, query, then uh, behind the scene some triggers basically uh, triggers uh, runs and that basically and that is that that that, that is the because uh, of that rollback is possible but when you try to delete all the records uh, within your table in efficient manner then truncate comes into the picture but when you run the truncate you don't have uh, uh, any uh, facility to specify where clause right so truncate will delete all the records from your table and there is no chance for rollback so let's see how we can uh, do the truncate operation so first of all i would say when i how do we delete the record so you write a delete uh, from uh, let's say i have a table is called dept10 so if i run this query then this is going to delete all the rows from dept temp right there is a basically uh, four rows in this table here we have opportunity to specify where clause. If you do not specify the where clause, then this is going to delete all the rows uh, from your table and that you don't want, right? And that's what you use delete, delete uh, query, right? If I run this application, then one row has been deleted. If I go and check, there could be, uh, let me refresh that one row has been deleted with department ID 10, right? Now, but, uh, but uh, delete is slower than the truncate now i would like to truncate or remove all the rows from the uh, this table uh, dept underscore temp table then i have to write a truncate query so you have to write truncate truncate and then table keyword will have to give and then table name right then this is going to delete all the rows from this table in one sort so saying that table dpt temp truncated if i go and check is there any record if i refresh then all the rows has gone away right so key points to remember over here the truncate is faster than the delete command this is because it generates no rollback information right right and does not fire any delete triggers right and that's the reason truncate is faster than delete so that's all I have in this video tutorial guys. Guys big thank you and see you there in the next video tutorial.